Yeah, we have, we have, we have here, here. Are you breaking up? No. Um, did someone just... Oh, Javi? Yes. Javi. Javi? Did Javi, go, did Javi jump down? He just jumped down. Yes. Is he knocked down? Javi? He's, he's definitely... Oh, he's coming back up. Oh, he won't go to prison no more. So, Guys, so what's going on? What happens there, boys? Run me through how y'all breach Hydra. I wasn't there. Okay, Javi, Pierre. Okay, so basically, we were trying to do the vault, right? Nobody was doing it. It was still open. And, um, you know, we set up for the, for the vault plan. You know, we set up bikes and stuff. We went to go buy the laptop. And then uh, we were driving to the vault to go hit it, and there's a there's a local shot in there. So um, we went inside, and uh, Yer, Molly, and Dee Dee were trying to figure out who it was. Um, Yer screamed out like four or five times, and um, instead of talking, they just shot Yer right away. And um, everybody else started shooting after that. Um, we dropped. Uh, four of them, and, uh, two of them were still up, and all of us got dropped. And, I guess they weren't able to hit the back, but they got, like, three, or whatever the first, uh, case was. Um, and then, uh, Hydra, or Miguel called me, he's like, 300k, or we blast, uh, blast you guys, and, um, and then me and you were talking and then wanted to pay 300k just because you know in a way we kind of fucked mm. him over too okay. um year didn't want to and then we both agreed that we should probably talk to um more people before paying about it, or paying okay and then yeah what else um, happened anything you want to say oh yeah i think you pretty much covered it I didn't want to pay 300 I thought that was like a ridiculously large amount since they got out with some of the loot as well. So this 200k that was paid, who paid it? Me and Yer. So you and Yer are broke now. Is that, well, Yer's probably not broke. You're probably broke. No, okay. How much you got, Javi? Mm, like 140, 150. Guys, why are we breaching banks? Other than, other than the fact that Y'all try to set up and I get that, you know, you wanted to hit the bank and obviously people were there. So obviously you want to breach, right? What happened there? Like, do you not see did the hydra not leave a note or anything like that? Cause I swear the last time nope. I was there, they nah, put there was in. No, no, no. Okay. No. Okay. They didn't even tell us they were hydra. They actually, they, just... they thought they did. They asked about that when I had a meeting with them. They thought they did, but they didn't. Okay. So listen boys. Okay. Let me just tell you something. All right. I, I understand what you guys want to do. Okay, but there's one big problem and it's not because I don't think you guys can clap. I honestly think if Seaside had a solid six that were awake other than me, you guys could do whatever the fuck you wanted to do. Right. Am, am I, am I right? Like I, I, I believe that, you know, you guys can hold it down no matter what. Yeah. But. That's not the case. That's not the case because we're, we're too sporadic with this shit. KJ doesn't know when he wakes up. Chico's around randomly. Years around the weekends. Javi is NA. Bodhi doesn't know which time he wants to wake up. That's the problem, man. So every time we go and start breaching banks, 
if you breach the wrong people, it starts making us look weak, boys. Is that not is that not accurate? And 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 now what what's happening with uh I know Mali was mentioned earlier by Ash. So so what's happening with Mali? She clear too? Or was it what's gonna happen now? She uh she went to sleep and was gonna sort that shit out later when she woke up. You you see what I mean? Not only is it us, you know, that has a problem. If something happens with Mali, then you guys pay 200k, then Yer wants to back her up too. Am I correct? Yeah. You, you see what I'm saying here? The decisions that are being made, man. Okay, so Ash, when you when you when you pay them the 200k, what what, what do you talk about? What what happens with Mali and shit? Uh, so they're pretty angry at Molly. There was apparently an incident that's happened recently with her, so they said to me, we are going after Molly anyway. Um, and, and why are so we okay with that? I mean, we're not okay with that. But the, what, do we, what do we do? That's what I'm okay. saying. Like, why we need to make sure that like, when we make these deals, guys, okay? I know it's not a, a deal that Ash is used to making or none of you guys as well. Because you're not really, you know, you didn't make those kind of deals back in the, back in the day. But we need to make sure everybody's okay, guys. And this is why we don't just breach with anybody because they get fucked up at the end. So now you guys are down 200k and Yer's girlfriend is potentially going to get clapped. And then Yer is going to want to step up for her, which we will understand. Then we will end up shooting anywhere. So you're going to be down 200k and still in a war. Because why? Because we like to breach. I don't, I don't know if it's relevant or not, but Molly kind of doesn't like Seaside at all. Doesn't like Seaside at all? What, what do you mean? Yeah, she had some really strong feelings about Chico and uh, Seaside in general. Like what? Why don't you tell me? Yeah, she, well, she said that like, um, like everybody is bending over backwards for Benji and Ash, but when it comes to Year and her, she did, like no one cares. And I don't know, it was... Uh, that's that's what she said. I don't know. Is that is that true? Yeah. Uh, that's the first I'm hearing about it. When did this guy get said, buddy? Um, two days ago, I was on the phone with her. What what do you what do you mean by bend over for Benji and Ash? Literally, I'm fucking getting bent over myself. What are you talking about? Yeah, you don't have to tell me. I I just listened to her what she said. I didn't. Say one way or say anything on the matter. Okay, but this she's, is she's starting her own thing, so that's very confusing to me. Since every almost everything I have, I share with the boys, and they get to do whatever the fuck they want to do. It's not, it's from gun running to drugs to everything else that we do, guys. I share everything, so that's bullshit. You guys know this. The KJ would oh, say I the fucking that. same thing as well. Listen, guys, okay? Yeah. I all I'm saying right now. Is that the decisions we make okay like breaching banks okay if you don't know who the fuck it is you might as well not do it you you get what i'm saying if you're not clear on who it is the risk is not worth it because it just makes us look weaker trust me you think you think i don't want to just you know say okay let's go and clap of course i do boys but y'all not ready yet we're not ready yet because we're not there yet and it's not because of shooting capability or whatever, because if I put the, if I put our best six shooters out there, I could sleep cozy in my bed and then you guys would be clapping all day long. Okay. But y'all need to remember that breaching should no longer be a thing, man, unless it is absolutely confirmed that it's not extra goddamn beef. The way this city is right now, boys. Okay. Let me tell you something. There could be one member of Chang Gang or Clean Boys inside a bank, okay, with five other random people. You breach that bank, they suddenly will feel like, you know, there's some people that say, oh, banks are just banks, it stays there. But then when they realize it's us and they want, you know, they want the smoke or they want, they want to test us out, that one person is going to be like, oh, yeah, we got breached by Seaside, say less, let's go and clap. You know, how do you guys feel about that, man? Yeah, I agree. Is there is there any actual need to be breaching? Because I feel like that's been happening a lot. 
No. Well, at first it was just because, you know, for fun. But then I stopped doing the breaching just to breach. And then, um... The, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then the other that's the other times we breached, mm -hmm. it was just kind of we got shot down. Well, yesterday when we did it with BBMC, we weren't breaching. We just wanted to see who it was first. But we bought the yeah. laptop already. And then today, I guess it was the same thing. It was like they had bought laptops yeah. already. Yeah. So I guess we'll just stop going up to the doors or something. Yeah, guys, this is this is pretty much uh, if you're gonna do something, we gotta do it right, man. But you know, otherwise it just keeps us making. Uh, every time you guys get shot down, it's just another L we take, and then people are gonna start, you know, demanding payment for every single thing that we do. And you guys are not ready with the guns yet, man. Not one of you have made an order yet, bro. Well, I have like six AKs. all of us Cody not just you you know what I'm saying like this, this is not this is not Gucci we're not ready for this you know what I mean if you want to if you want to be acting a certain way we got to be ready okay I'll talk to all the boys we have a big meeting let's start doing shit properly man we I can, we cannot be taking these L's like that bro it doesn't make sense Benji, let's um we can do the thing that you talked to me yes about we day. will do that we will do that I will put it up north okay. this is this is ridiculous guys we got so. about 90 Oxy, I've been trying to give you as well. Yeah, that's, like, that's the kind of shit we need. Take it. Okay. Yeah, 90 Oxy, hell yeah. The, okay, so this is this is how I want things to be, all right? We need to be the ones that get breached and then we make a big fuss out of it instead of the other way around. Okay. Because that's better for us, you know? Like, that's something that we can handle and that's how you can get to test yourself. So we can telegraph that we're doing banks and so people are... In no, place. man! Which part? Why do you need to be breached or getting uh, or start breaching? Why? Well, we're not. No, we're not. We're not breaching. We'll just do banks and like telegraph to other people. Hey, we're doing a bank so that they like feel obligated to breach and then we can. No, that's exactly order. not. Why are you forcing the issue, dude? Is I it mean, okay? Are you guys craving conflict or what? No, no, no. You said that you wanted to wait for people to I just people. want things to happen naturally and we're not forcing things, I'm not, buddy. I'm not forcing anything. Okay. okay. We yeah, well well you're telegraphing to people that you're doing a bank with the hope we'll and that. intention that they fucking breach you. No, 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 that's, no, that's forcing that's not, it. No, that's that's wrong. That's I don't I, I don't mean it like that. I, I take that back. I would do you, banks on the low key. Well, can you put your name on the board like the Hydra guys, they thought they put their name on the wall when they bought the laptop. Could you do that? Yeah, we could do that. That's kind of what I meant. Guys, I'm, I'm running out of patience too, man. You know? I'm, I'm reaching the point. Okay, let's go and clap. And then you guys are just going to suffer. And then we're all eating dirt. Do you, do you guys get my predicament right now? The problem? Y'all yeah, yeah. are yeah. acting in a way that you want to be clapping, right? But you ain't yeah. ready to clap for two weeks, so don't do it. Yeah. That's that's a good point. I'll help. I'll help everybody. If you money. have no guns, no oxy, no money, you have no say in putting seaside into war, and none of this shit. Where you think it's gonna be not a seaside thing, boys? It doesn't work like that. The second they smell that I'm a part of something too, they just want to clap. Fuck! No more breaching. Okay, is that clear? Is that better? Okay. No more fucking mm -hmm. breaching. Right. If you breach, I'll join the gang you breach, and I'll clap you with the guns that you okay. were supposed to have. Okay. Okay. No fucking breaching. No more. Wait till I'm around and I'll tell you to breach or not. Holy fuck, you guys are stupid, man. You're fucking me up right now. Get back in the car. Fucking breach these fucking nuts. Keep on breaching and shit. How the fuck we breaching? One guy in the goddamn car got six million. I got two. We got uwu. How the fuck y'all poor, man? You're shit criminals uh, yeah. if you can't be making money, bro. I'm trying to help them make money and like I've been taking Javi to lots of jobs and Antonio too. I don't know how they don't have money. 
listen sounds to me right now okay javi yeah you know what your problem is you're all trying to hit bags at the hardest times hit the fucking yacht with body man at least you get to see the people swimming to breach you yeah and if it's bbmc we can just shoot them in the water no questions and what's going on with bbmc what happened there what's this pocket wiping shit that's going on Well, we were this is pretty much similar to what happened with the vault, but uh, we literally parked on the side and we ran up to the grass and then the, like two seconds when I got out the car, I just got shot down. And then uh, I heard Dundee and I was like, he asked who I was. I was like, Javi Seaside. And then they just continued to pocket wipe. And what happened there? Did you talk to him yet? Uh, I think we got the stuff back. Mm -hmm. Right, Bodhi? Yeah, we, so I, I, mean, I spoke sort of, to them. Like, yeah. got some stuff back. Yeah. Look, look, listen, you shouldn't have gone there with fuck. Okay, listen. So they, they took a bunch of shit out of their pockets, which honestly, they shouldn't have taken all that shit out of their pockets, right? Okay. And I spoke to Pez about it, and Pez even agreed. He said, they shouldn't have taken that stuff. I'll give it back. Right? So they gave back the majority of it. Your radios, your guns, fuck, whatever. You don't get new ones. But like, your racing goggles and shit, like you guys were blaming BBMC for taking them. Fucking Crackhead Craig took them. You know? We didn't know like, that until he said he did. What do you mean, Crackhead Craig took him? They took him off like, you. No, he stole him out of the car. Craig wasn't involved, and he saw our car. Like, he didn't know it was our car. And he got in it, and he found my dongle, and he, and he took it. Like, just completely unrelated. Just coincidental. Listen, that listen, he listen, to be listen. There. You, see, you see what I mean, guys? Like, this kind of shit, man. This fucks the rapper, bro. And then y'all gonna feel like shit. If people treat seaside like pieces of dirt, bro. Know what you're fucking guys, you know the game, man. Come on. This is the politics you gotta you, fucking handle. You know, yesterday Pez called me because he wanted to buy one hundred thousand dollars worth of rifle ammo. They needed it for the war. They needed it right now for the war right now. Let's go. I didn't have any. Craig had ten boxes, and you know what? Craig went and just gave them the ten boxes, like, yo, here you go, guys, good luck with the war. And like they're giving him stuff now, like they, you know, they're like, thank you so much, you know, like they're really thankful, and they're giving him stuff to pay him back, like more than what he gave them. And now they're not at war anymore. They don't need a hundred k worth of ammo anymore. So you missed out on that sale. You missed out on that money because you were hung up on a phone dongle. No, it wasn't about the dongle. I, I already explained that. It was that about not letting people walk over. Just me. boys, listen, okay. The biggest problem here, okay? Let me let me tell you something, okay? Because the three of you are the fucking problem right now, okay? Y'all need to just fucking chill, okay? Y'all need to fucking chill because we need to do everything naturally. I've said it 2000 fucking times already. The time will come when the beast will be unleashed, okay? Just please wait for my call. No more breaching. We calm down because we still got shit on our plate. Even the lost might want the fucking smoke, bro. Even Hydra yeah. might still want the goddamn smoke. So right now is the time you fucking prep. Then we got this. What is this shit Bodhi talking about street team? He blew them up. Yeah. Um. Listen, I had a blue laptop that I, I wasn't going to use because we bought it. And then BBMC ended up doing the Polito, right? So I picked it up at the end of the storm to sell to somebody the next one. And I was going to go to sleep. And Lil Bleach calls me to buy it. And I'm like, yeah, sure. Let's meet at Bay City. So I show up at Bay City. And I'm like, all right, here's a laptop. Um, we'll just head into the bank and you can pay me. And then he's like, oh, thanks. And he just drives away. And then um, I was just like, all right, well, I'll see you at the bank, buddy. And then so I planted a C4 with the intention of blowing up their hostage as right as the cops showed up. Not when, not till they made con, not like, not as they made contact, you know, before they made contact, so they would fuck their bank, but they never showed up. So I think I just ended up blowing like a couple of them up. I don't, I don't know. I still don't know. And then I went to sleep after. Uh, Did they so know it's you? Know. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Well, that's another pile of fucking shit. You see what I mean? So, Holy fuck. Yeah, so I don't know if, if they want to clap me or, or something. I wonder Hydra was so extra upset. You think Hydra is extra upset because of the thing I did? I would say so, yeah. But isn't Street Team not Hydra? 
<laughs> They're all connected. <laughs> you know it's the same thing. <laughs> My only regret is I didn't plant the C4 where the car was. If I planted it where the car was, I would have gotten all six of them. Listen, okay. We, we're just doing a lot of stuff right now, boys, where, you know, we're waiting for that moment where we didn't do anything wrong. So that the, the, our, our reply, or our actions are justified, right? Now, when you, when, when you base everything off like bank breaching, it becomes a very gray area because you did try to fuck their bank up, you know, what if you did take out all six of them? Then the story would still be the same you, you know what i mean they'd probably be demanding more than what they what they were asking for that's always the risk that you take whenever you're doing these breachings or whatever fucking scenario you want to talk about and right now we just need to find a place where people actually try to fuck with us you know like and it just doesn't make sense and we did everything we, we could to prevent it and that's when the true test starts right because right now y'all y'all have the energy okay but you, unfortunately your energy is getting cancelled out by by hydra cg energy you know what i'm saying it just doesn't work because you guys know it will be endless and don't don't get don't get this wrong guys okay as much as i love the cg boys like hydra and stuff they know who's backing they got that's why they got that air of confidence and arrogance bro they can do whatever the fuck they want and they know it you know what I'm saying? Uh, don't get me wrong. Like BBMC, the way they were rolling, bro. If if Hydra and Street Team were like a separate entity that were not backing each other up, they would have fucking taken them. You know what I mean? Like BBMC were the hold, BBMC were holding them the fuck down. They, they knew what they were doing. It's just you can't you can't keep going back to back. You can't handle that shit. And that is it guys for the video, like, share and subscribe if you want more. Thank you.